Welcome to Alter. I'm your host, Nicole Moline. This podcast explores the practice of transformation, of growth, as a dance between hustle and flow. Altering, changing, growing, becoming, and altering, offering, surrendering, opening to divine conspiracy. It's the dance of the leader, athlete, creator, entrepreneur, committed not just to optimal expression, but to exceptional being. So here are adventures in sweat and divine conspiracy. Awake to all the grit, dirt, and complexity of our world. Alert to the graces that come alongside the struggle, the hustle, encouragement, an infusion of courage for the moments you need it most. I'm your host, Nicole Moline. Welcome to Alter. Hi, my friends. 2024. Let's take a deep breath into it. How does it feel in your body, in your spirit? How are you armored from it? How are you protecting yourself? Maybe from disappointment, from risk, protecting yourself from dreaming. The last few years have been so much to integrate. And it makes sense in light of all the unexpected elements of the last few years and the violence we've seen, especially in the last few months in the Middle East, to protect ourselves, to hedge our bets to armor ourselves from hoping and dreaming. Maybe if you're honest with yourself, some new cynicism has begun to set in over the last few years. How grounded are you at this moment facing this new year? How clear in your vision? How open? Have you taken a moment yet to get clear and to declare what you want to create and magnetize this year and how you want to grow. May these next few weeks be that for you. I've created a few experiences to lead you in dreaming bravely. The deep dive is my course called Your Dream Year. It's volume one in my three volume visionary master course for spirited leaders, including volume two, Sourced, and volume three, which is coming early this year, Spirited Leadership. It's a journey with me to design the year of your dreams, especially if you have ever considered doing personal mentorship or coaching with me. Take this course. I have poured so many of my tools for spiritual growth, for clarifying your vision for your next chapter, manifesting your deepest dreams, taking brave, aligned action, magnetizing resources, and healing a broken heart into this course. Your dream year is full of illuminating questions and practices to show up to this year in your radiance and vibrancy, regardless of what surprises this year has for you. All six modules contain collections of videos that are intentionally brief and rich So you can watch or just listen to maybe just one a day over the course of this month and let it unfold in you. I'm offering special New Year's pricing the first week of January, and you can learn more and register at nicolemaline.com slash visionary. If you want a guided workshop with me to envision your goals for 2024 in all spheres of your life and give you a taste of the Dream Your Course Join me for the Envision 2024 workshop, which is linked at the bottom of the Dream Year course page at nicolemaline.com slash visionary, and also linked in the show notes here. This was a powerful 90-minute gathering I hosted last week, and perfect for you to drop into at your perfect time, especially this first month of the year. And the third offering is the Joy Ride completely free and my gift to you to welcome the new year with joy and some sweat confetti and give you a taste of the altar together platforms, soulful workouts. 
Join for free at nicolemoline.com slash joyride. One word, J-O-Y-R-I-D-E. I put deep intention and care and prayer into designing all three of these for you and hard-earned wisdom and poetry and joy. Let's talk about dreaming bravely. This is my alternative title for the Your Dream Your course, which I've thought about changing, but I love the audacity of a course called Your Dream Year. Really? In this wildly unpredictable moment in time, in this tumultuous world, we can design a dream year? Yes, we can. For two reasons. First, clarity is the strongest magnet in the universe. You cannot even imagine what will come to you when you become crystal clear on your vision. Distill your priorities. Build protective boundaries around your path and your purpose and begin to take courageous, aligned action. And second, as we fully explore in your dream year and in the Envision Workshop, your dreams are only secondarily about their actualization or accomplishment. They are primarily a path to you becoming the highest, strongest, bravest version of yourself. God stirs in us our wildest dreams to graduate us. The dreams you can barely imagine coming true because they seem so far off. The dreams that are in conversation or argument with your fears and your self-doubt. Those dreams. Dreams so big, the current version of you can't accomplish them. The current version of you doesn't have the resources. Dreams so big, you have to grow into them. You have to up-level yourself, graduate to a new version. And this process, this growing up, this growing into ourselves is the gift. And it becomes more important than the accomplishment or the timeline of actualization. If you ask anyone who's accomplished some incredible hard-won feat like winning an Olympic medal or building a successful business or organization, they will tell you the greatest gift was becoming the person who could do this. Learning, growing, failing, failing better, as Samuel Beckett puts it. Fail, fail again, fail better. Progressing. So the gift of clarifying your dreams and your purpose and aligning yourself with it is who you become along the way. However long and swervy and surprising that way turns out to be. In yoga, there is this concept of the drishti, which means the gaze. When you enter a pose that challenges your balance, you set your drishti. You set your gaze on something steady, maybe a point on the wall or the edge tip of your mat. And it's amazing how when you anchor your gaze, it anchors you. You stay in the pose instead of falling out of it You find this calm and quiet deep down inside of you you didn't know was there. You can't predict what will come at you this year. You can set your drishti. You can decide who you want to become. You can't guarantee you will accomplish every goal you set this year because of variables outside of your control. You can become the person capable of accomplishing your goals the person on the road to them. That's how I see this last year for me, a year of foundation building, practices establishing, refining platforms, creating and refining procedures, both spiritually and creatively and professionally, the behind the scenes and under the foundation stuff that's not so flashy. But if it's not there, you can only build so high before things start to crack. Even relationally, practicing showing up with an open heart, with refined boundaries, with clearer, braver communication. Progress, progress, progress. 
progress over perfection, foundations. I love Tony Robbins statement that we tend to overestimate what we can accomplish in a year and underestimate what we can accomplish in 10 years. The writer Zora Neale Hurston opens her astonishing novel, Their Eyes Were Watching God, with this statement. There are years that ask questions and years that answer. Some years are full of swift manifestation and answers to prayers. And some years are full of the slow, underground work of making sure we're asking the right questions and being shaped by asking them. Some years hollow us out to dream bigger and braver than what we've been settling for. I want to speak over you the manifesto of the Visionary Master Course and call you into leadership this year, beginning with self-leadership, with leading yourself in honor of your bravest dreams. A visionary dwells in possibility, sees beyond what is, senses what wants to become, is gratefully present in the now and in love with the future. Rooted in abundance, healing ancestral wounds, attuned to intuition, attentive to spirit's invitation, intentional in rituals as the sacred architecture of creative freedom, practices courage, embraces imperfection, fails better every attempt a teacher, celebrates the cracks that let in the light, knows when to hustle and when to flow, leads from alongside, spreads the welcome mat of vulnerability that invites a community to dream expansively, to become more of themselves, envisions and revises a map heartward. This vision is my wish for us this year and the path the visionary course charts as it applies to you. From my heart to yours, Join me in the Visionary Your Dream Year course or the Envision Workshop. I would love to lead you to design the year of your dreams, to design the you of your dreams as we alter, grow, change, become together. Happy New Year. Thank you.